Earlier today I was out shopping at the Safeway here in Stockton and a little kid came up and was real curious about the bubble hood I was wearing and um, he actually reminded me of how I was when he, I was his age, very inquisitive, very curious about things and before people say, oh people should mind their own business if somebody looks like they're wearing something medical I figure this was a little kid and I'd rather satisfy his curiosity to make corrective towards him. This is the bubble hood itself. It just laid out and ready to go. I put in a um, filter, cloth filter in the front here. It has a 12 volt blower inside that I'll show in a little bit. And a clear plastic lens and the fabric goes all the way around. And um, from the back, actually from the inside, you can see the blower in here wired to the battery pack which I made with um, a set of 12 1.2 volt rechargeables and since I, I didn't put a switch in what I did was I take one battery out and plug it in to get the blower going you can probably hear it now I just have one strap and one one strap and a wire in one arm and the other on the other. And this lasts about four hours or so on a charge, good enough for a week of shopping activity and everything. And, um, and it works a lot better than a mask for me because I'm autistic and can't stand a mask actually on my face. How I made it is um, I got a set of two 6-cell battery holders and wired them together. And um, this is how I turn it off. I just take one battery out and leave it in the pouch with the rest of them. So that way I don't forget it. And up here is actually a charger with the next set of cells ready to go. The setter charger. It's kind of fluky, so I don't use it too much anymore. This used to be an actual uniform that I made of... Um, a character for Full Metal Alchemist. I had to use it for spare parts and um, the plastic is a 12 mil vinyl that I stitched in very carefully to make sure there weren't any holes or gaps. That would be unsightly and kind of take away the use of it. This is a two layer cloth filter using the guidelines for mask making. It has some needle point mesh plastic canvas on the inside kind of boxing it so it doesn't just suck into the blower and cut off airflow. And it's all just sewn together pretty much like a tube collar with a pair of shoulder straps to go underneath and the wire comes out. So if a kid or an autistic person or someone has a curious question about something and you can answer it, feel free to answer them and, you know, in a friendly sort of way. And that way they can select their curiosity and they'll remember you as a nice person.